Hi guys, in this lecture I'm going to show you how to install Linux Mint on VirtualBox in Windows 11 machine, okay? So first of all, we will download and install VirtualBox in Windows 11 machine. Download VirtualBox, click this link to download the file since I'm using the Windows machine, so I will click Windows host. So this will start the download process. So I already have this file in my system, so I'm going to cancel this and I will open the installer file, okay? Let me just open the installer file and this will begin the installation, okay? Click next. I accept the terms and condition. So this is where it will be installed. Click next. Yes. Next, install. And this will begin the installation process. So it will take some time to complete. So you have to wait for a while until this is done and dusted, okay? Just be patient. Okay, it has been installed. Now I'm going to click finish. So the first step is done and dusted. Now I'm going to uh, download the Linux Mint ISO file. So again, I will open the Google Chrome browser and, and I will type download Linux Mint. Okay, then I'm going to click this link. Okay, so there are different versions of uh, Linux Mint. So I'm going to download the Cinnamon Edition. So I will click download and this is going to take me to this page. Size is 3 GB and I have to select mirror. Okay. So if you are living in USA, you can select these different mirrors. If you're living in Canada, you have these two choices. So I'm going to click this one. Okay. Location world. So this is going to start the download process. So I have already downloaded this file. So I'm going to cancel it from here. Okay. Let me just open my e directory where I have placed the ISO file. Okay. I have already downloaded this file and I have placed it in here in this directory. Now I need to open the Oracle virtual box. Okay. But before that I need to disable the internet in order to have a smooth, uh, installation okay just disconnect and let me just open the oracle virtual box i'm going to right click and i will run as administrator click yes okay Th then i will create a new virtual machine and i will name this virtual machine as linux mint uh, virtual okay then I'm going to select the ISO image. I have to provide the ISO image, the path. Let me just select this. Okay. Now, uh, fine. Then I will click next. I have to provide the username. Let me just set the username to this password. I will set one, two, three Q W E as my password. 123QWE as my password. Okay. So just remember the password because you will be required in the later stage. Click next. Okay. Here I'm going to specify memory as 4GB. CPUs I will specify 4 CPUs. Okay. In order to have a better performance. Click next. Okay. Click next. Finish. And this is going to start the. Uh, Linux Mint virtual machine, but I have to start it. Okay, first, this is going to start it. Okay, you just need to wait for a while. Okay, it has been started. Uh, now I'm going to specify the ISO image because I have, uh, okay, this one. Okay, this one I'm going to specify, which is located here. M mount and retry boot. Okay. Let me just view and let me just select the scale mode. Switch to this mode.
So in order to install, I'm going to click this install Linux Mint. Let me just double click it and just wait until it shows something. Okay. So I will select English and I will click continue. And then, okay, English, US keyboard layout, click continue. So I don't want to install multimedia right now if you want to. So you have to click check this option. OK, I'm not going to check this. Click continue. So I'm going to check this option. Erase disk can install Linux Mint. Don't worry, it, it won't do anything. OK, just install now. Click install now. OK, click continue. Click continue. Now I'm going to provide my name here, okay, and my password is this, click continue. So installation has finished. Now I'm going to click restart now. Press enter. Now I need to provide the password here. Okay, so the installation has been completed. I hope you have gone through the process of installing Linux Mint on VirtualBox in Windows 11 machine. Uh, thank you so much. In the end, I would request you to please subscribe, like and share.